she's just she's Look it, look it, that's me! Human cowgirl. <laughs> no small amount of enthusiasm comes out of that Jessie the cowgirl. She's a cowgirl through and through. She's basically can do. She's not hiding anything. Everything's right out there on the table for you. And I, I like that a lot. For us, <laughs> for us as, as women, you know, it's like, yeah, a strong female yeah. character. She's yeah. great. Don't think just because you're a girl, I'm going to take it easy on you. Yeah! It was a wonderful uh, opportunity for us to design a character who was linked to the past, linked to the American West and American history, but also give her a very contemporary, very modern persona. That critter needs help! When you're developing a character, you always like to, to explore every single avenue. You can get a very wide variety of different looks from different people. Some of them are nowhere near the mark and, in fact, quite hideous. You sure about this? No! In some of the early drawings, Jesse actually had a skirt. What, are you crazy? Cowgirls don't wear skirts. <laughs> So therefore we thought, well, let's make her more of a tomboy, but make her really cute. It was really Jill Colton who did a couple of key drawings that really nailed it. We just thought, well, that's Jessie. Can you believe it? When we start animating a character like this, we have to figure out how she's going to move. The best way to describe Jessie's style of movement is rambunctious. Her walk is kind of cowgirlish, how she's kind of like bow-legged and she's kind of... You know. But at the same time, the animators had to think in terms of her being a toy and keeping that fluid and loose and fusing those things together. Yeah! She's so cute. Finding the voice in any animated character is is huge. You don't have the character until you have the voice. Bullseye! I don't remember whose idea it was to test out Jen Cusack, but whoever it was was pretty smart. She gave Jesse so much life. Sweet mother of Abraham Lincoln, the prospector, he'll want to meet ya! It's just an honor to be the voice of something that's so, um, magnificent. Well, I just want to say you're a bright young woman with a beautiful yarn full of hair. A hair full of yarn. It's, uh, well, um, <clears throat> I must go. We got to have a character who is really fun and out there and at first kind of like, whoa. Ha! She takes Woody and throws him around and, you know, and it's you, it's you, it's you. It's you, it's you, it's you, it's you, it's you, it's you. It's you. <laughs> okay, I'm officially freaked out now. Jesse the cowgirl, hey, easy, whoa, slow down. And then later on, you know, that energy just goes <laughs> When you find out her history, it just breaks your heart. When somebody loved me, everything was beautiful. She was a little girl's favorite toy, and then the little girl grew up, and she was left behind. It's so sad. <laughs> I know. Randy Newman's wonderful song, When She Loved Me, showed all those emotions. Lonely and forgotten. I was just trying to write a song about how you'd feel if you were discarded and didn't understand it. It's a heavy song and it's really beautiful and sad and completely melancholy and nostalgic. When that song came on, you just hear everybody sniffling or reaching for a tissue. When she loved me. The audience's reaction to Jessie has been overwhelming. They fall in love with her. I think Jessie's a great role model. She's independent. Really uh, spirited, spunky. Really brave. Goes after what she believes in. She's just too cute. She's really neat. Yeah. yeah, really funny. The person who makes her should be very proud. She's my favorite, favorite character. Yeehaw! 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 Come on, Jess. It's time to take you home. But what if Andy doesn't like me? Nonsense! Andy will love you. Besides, he's got a little sister. He does? Why don't you say so? Let's go! Whoa! The fact that Jesse's getting the Patsy Montana Award, it's like, wow, what company to be in. Oh, Bullseye! We're part of a family again! I'm really happy for Jessie. <laughs> it's going to be good for her career, I think. <laughs> the fact that an animated character is winning an award that, that real humans have ever only won, I think is just incredible. They don't know she's not real. That's the deal. <laughs> <laughs> Shh, that's our, that's our little, little secret. secret. <laughs> what? You think I did that? 
That character is so incredibly real and believable. She has become a, a character that people forget is animated. And that's what we strive for. We did it! We did it! We did it! <laughs> Madam Chairwoman, members of the board, ladies and gentlemen, and my fellow cowgirls. I've always known that being 13 and a half inches tall doesn't make you any less of a cowgirl. You just have to ride a shorter horse. <laughs> but to find out that I've been given the honor of receiving the Patsy Montana Entertainer of the Year Award from the Cowgirl Hall of Fame, to stand tall among so many inspirational, courageous women. Well, there's just one word to describe how I'm feeling right now. Yay! <laughs> if I could, I'd like to say something to the youngest cowgirls out there. Be kind to critters. Carry yourself with grit and grace. Find your own trail and follow it with faith and courage. And always saddle your own horse. I just wish I could rope you all in and give you a great big hug. Thank you again from the bottom of my heart. Ride like the wind, bullseye! <laughs> 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 